Governor Mills is mandating some non-essential businesses to close down. Um, right. For small business owners across the state, they're kind of left in limbo. What have you been hearing um, from your position? We've been talking to a lot of our small businesses. They've been calling to let us know about their situation um, and trying to get guidance from us on what we would recommend that they do. Many of them need um, some immediate assistance and we're offering some payment deferrals or interest only loan payments for up to three months while they figure out what's gonna happen to their businesses. Um, there are some solutions on the federal side, on the state side for longer term loans. Um, but I think that what we're trying to do is encourage businesses to work with their lenders that they have a relationship with so they can get counseling about what is, what is the best solution for them. We don't want them taking on additional debt until they know when the business is gonna open back. So what are some of the good questions maybe uh, small businesses should ask their banks um, going through a tough time like this? The first question is, can I have some relief on my immediate loan payments if they have loan payments? The banks are very set up to address that. We understand the circumstances and we can defer payments. You just need to talk to us about what's going on in your business and we can respond really quickly. That's the most immediate thing that can be done. Secondarily, there are some programs like economic injury loans that are available through the Small Business Administration that can provide longer term relief to help companies rebuild after they open back up. But uh, those do require a lot more paperwork and what I would call administrivia to get going. And FAME has uh, for a short time have a 90 day bridge loan that they can offer to help customers that have been approved for an injury loan but haven't been funded yet. From my perspective, that's taking on additional debt that um, we'd want to have a conversation with the borrower first about what do you need today and then what do you need longer term to help your business restart when you open back up. Are banks pretty secure right now? The banks are in very good shape. I mean, even during the last economic crisis, Maine banks fared very well. So our banks are very strong in the state of Maine. We're very strong. Um, our issue is that we are an essential service, so we have to be open, and we're prioritizing keeping our employees safe. We've closed our branch lobbies in order to prevent them from interacting with somebody who may have the virus. So we have drive-up tellers available. Our um, back office staff are working from home so that we keep the social distancing. That's our priority, is to keep our employees safe, but continue with all the essential banking services that we offer, and that's what we're all able to do. The banks are strong. Um, we just need to be here as a resource for our customers.